usually it's obligatory to talk about this team first, and that is the Dallas Cowboys. How about them Cowboys. Last year, they were a massive <laughs> disappointment. Um, they were absolutely terrible. Part of it was because Dak went down. Another part of it was because their defense absolutely stunk. Um, now this year, they're on hard knocks. Um, Dak might come back. They have a new attitude this year. Jerry's eating egg McMuffins with tons of salt now. Um, Matt, what are your first thoughts when you uh, when you think of the Cowboys this year? Uh, my first, my very first thought is uh, Big Mike looks just like Big Lebowski. <laughs> like with that beard coming in, it's just like, dude, like he's trying some things, but um, defense looks pretty bad as normal. I think it's a little bit better than last year, but they did lose their corners. So it's like, yeah, we'll see how that goes. I mean, they still have Jalen Smith. They got um, Boise State's uh, Van uh, Marcus Lawrence. They have Demarcus Lawrence, but uh, what um, Van something? Oh, yeah. Leighton Vander Ash. Vander Ash. Or has he was a first round pick, but he's gotten hurt every single year. The offense doesn't look too bad if Dak plays. Mm-hmm. Um, I did hear a report that Dak may be out majority, if not all, of the season uh, with his shoulder injury and other ailing injuries that are kind of left over. But um, yeah, it's not looking too great for the Cowboys. But in a division where every team will probably have a losing record, I mean, anything's possible. It- CD there, Lamb there looks was, really good. Sorry. CD Lamb looks really good. Oh, yeah. I mean, there was encouraging news just today. Dak did return to 11 on 11 practice. So maybe there's a little bit more optimism there. Okay. I, they're definitely relying on Dak because, I mean, their backup is some guy named Cooper Rush. So they, they definitely need Dak to play to have success this year. If they do, I mean, they have a decent offensive line. It's not great, it, but it's definitely towards the top half of the NFL. They got some great receivers with, um, obviously, like you mentioned, C.D. Lamb coming on. Um, Amari Cooper. Help is still there. Amari Cooper, if he can ever get consistent, I'm not sure if he will. He's very talented, though. But And then, obviously, the running back, they got Zeke and um, Pollard, who was coming on as well. The offense looks pretty good if everyone stays healthy. But uh, can they stop people on defense? That's the thing. Yeah, it's a major if. Obviously, they added Micah Parsons' first round pick this offseason. Oh, yeah, that's going to be huge they, for them. They still definitely have a lot of work to do with that defense. 